And I wanted to show you what a multi-million dollar house looks like starting now. What is up Mason Gang and welcome to another episode of the Mason Gang vlog. We are in TCI. Our house is Punta del Sogno. I don't know if that's how you say it. Ponte del Sogno. Right here on our left, we have some beautiful palm trees. Got areas for the cars, it's always important. And then we got ourselves a lovely guest house. You have everything you need. Screen and porch, come in here. And you got yourself a lovely kitchen, little living space, fans, because it's burning in here. You got a little master bedroom, and you got a master bathroom. Cool part about this house is you go from the guest house over a lovely bridge, and then you go to the main house, it's right over there. So this bridge is called Serenity Bridge because it's, well, super peaceful. Just, you're 20 feet above the ground, and uh, it's pretty calming. I haven't seen them yet, but see those big holes down there? It's actually a couple of big crabs that live down there. But uh, this is the main entrance. And when we walk into the main house, we're greeted with a lovely living space. We got Michael in here banging drawers looking for yogurt. I don't know how hard you were banging them, but you could hear them all the way down Serenity Bridge. <laughs> this is the kitchen. So you come right in, you can see all the way through. It's just a beautiful ocean out there. This is a laundry room right off of the kitchen. You have these big ceilings. It's just beautiful. Give you some different angles. So now that we've gone through the living room, and then as we come on through, we hit the master bedroom. Off of the master, we go out and just look at the beautiful ocean and the beautiful wife in a hammock. Serenity at its finest. You go all the way through. You have a master bathroom in here. You have a indoor shower, indoor bathtub. Cool thing is, outdoor shower. So cool. We walk outside of the main house, we follow this corridor, and this is where the bedrooms are. So we have bedroom number one, looking out over the ocean. Oh, I'll give you a sneak peek. So we walk through here, walk across. We actually have a second bedroom here. Walk across, another bedroom. And now we've gone through the bedrooms in the main house. Let's go to the part you've all been waiting to see. This is what makes it a multi-million dollar house, so get ready for this. This here is why you come to Turks and Caicos. This gorgeous ocean, seating area, poolside. Look, just an amazing pool. And just incredible ocean views. Can also see that you got this awesome pool house. It has a lovely kitchen. And lastly, I think the part that's really cool. You start to head down to the ocean and you have seating areas. You have pathways. You can just find your own little areas nestled into the rocks. Would you take a look at that? It's pretty awesome. You even got a step ladder there get down into the water and back.
now that I've shown you the house, I thought it would probably be pretty valuable if I just show you the top beaches that we love around here. So the first beach we're gonna go to is Taylor's Beach. I'm gonna bring a GoPro because it's going to storm. You can see out there, storm clouds are coming. And Taylor's Beach is relatively close to this house. So we are gonna just walk over with a GoPro, get a swim in before the rain comes, and we'll probably hit up another beach later. thing about Taylor Beach is that this whole area is super shallow. You can see how close I am to the beach right now. We're out, we're actually in Michael R. And a quick snap, I'll be out there. See, just like that. Out in the middle of the bay. I'm still dry. I've only got up to my waist. It's pretty cool. You could actually go quite a ways. Uh, actually more like over there, go out quite a ways, but there's little baby crab holes and uh, you know, it's scary. So I'm gonna get in the water and play some catch before that storm arrives. Other beach that you have to go to, and yes, it's the biggest of all beaches, is Grace Bay Beach. It's kind of windy today, but this is a about a 14 mile beach that extends all the way around the far east side of the island. So you got like the Ritz Carlton, Seven Stars, a lot of good stuff. So we might not see as much as I expected because uh, Mama Mason, she dropped Papa Mason's glasses into the ocean. Therefore, uh, Ronald, my father, Papa Mason, is blind, so we had to drive and find a clinic to get him some type of prescription so he can drive again. But this is their doctor. People check in at that door, they get their prescriptions at the green door, they go from this door at the entrance to either the medical building, the eye clinic, the chiropractor, or the urgent care. And it's really interesting that this is essentially how their big doctor office works and there's just tons of people here. People will just come up, ring the bell, see if the doctor's in. They don't have an appointment or anything, they'll just ask if the doctor's there. Sometimes he is, sometimes he isn't. Sometimes people will go in, sometimes people leave. Fascinating. Back at the house, it's pretty cool. You can just go off of the ledge here into the ocean. You can see Michael is deceased. You can go along these rocks, take a look around, enjoy some fishes. Having fun, Michael? Are you having fun? Oh, yeah. You getting sick? No. Oh, nice. So this is the fancy restaurant called Coco Bistro which is super cool. Take a look at this. You walk in, little Coco Bistro bar, come through, pretty little house, and then bang. I must say, all these lights, this is pretty awesome. It's not gonna be a snazzy place to eat tonight. That is for sure. With that, I think I'm gonna say goodbye. So, I love all of you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next episode of The Mason Gang.